Do you have so many shared drives in Google that you just can't keep track of them all and you wish maybe you could prioritize the ones you use often and maybe kind of like eh, get rid of the ones that you don't use as often? Stay tuned, let's see how to do that. Hi everybody, Rick Bray with the Plick team at Broomtown Gabosis coming at you from the Plick underground, here to talk to you today a little bit about uh, shared drives inside Google Drive. Now, when shared drives came out a little while ago, uh, they were called team drives, and we talked about them a little bit in a video. I'll, I'll put a card up there to it. Um, and things have changed, you know, and now they're called shared drives. Now, there's a few things about shared drives that I just, I don't find wonderful, aside from just the name looking at you, Google, because it's not easy to confuse shared with me and shared drive at all. Anyway, uh, looking back, when you get into shared drives, the more you use them, you just get tons and tons and tons of shared drives, and sometimes they have similar names, and it's just hard to keep them straight. And there's some shared drives that, uh, like I'll say for me, I use very often, and some that I don't use as often. So I still want access, but I wish I could just move them out of the way. Well, uh, I found out thanks to a tip from a coworker of mine, this has probably been around for a while, but it's new to me. You can hide those share drives. How do you do that? Well, you'll notice uh, in the upper right-hand corner of your screen, it says, or may or may not say, depending on your setup, hidden shared drives. If you, if you find a drive that you would like to hide, like maybe I wanna hide this Tech Talks, I'm going to right click on it in Google Drive and just hide the shared drive. Poof, it's gone from view, but but it's, it's still there. Don't worry, you still have access to it. Um, and then the next logical question that we asked was, well, how can I either unhide them or how can I get access to them? Well, that's under that hidden shared drives. So if you wanna find a drive that you hid, just click on the hidden ones and you'll notice in the top, it now says these are the hidden shared drives. I could go back to that one, which I wish I could remember what it was. Aha, TED Talks, uh, no, Tech Talks. Sorry, no copyright infringement there. Uh, I can now unhide it and boop, it goes back to the visible ones. And I can click right here back to shared drives. So that's how you can organize your shared drive space a little bit by right clicking on those files and clicking hide the shared drive. If you wanna view your hidden drives, just make sure you're looking at the top of the screen. I can't scroll, let me refresh. And you'll see up at the top, it will say, there it is, hidden shared drives. That's where you view them. So I hope you found this video helpful. Uh, if you did, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. You're more than welcome to subscribe to this notification and hit, uh, subscribe to this channel and hit that notification bell to get notifications when new content like this video is posted. And for all of you out there in teacher land, we see the hard work you're doing and we appreciate it. Keep up that great work.